Have you been involved in a car accident on US-19 in Pinellas County? Here at St. Petersburg Personal Injury Attorneys McQuaid and Douglas, we specialize in car accident cases throughout Pinellas County. And we found that US-19 is absolutely the number one location for very violent, severe, and just simply most common area for car accident cases throughout the entire county. Now, if you live in Pinellas County, this is not a surprise to you. You know that uh, virtually every day in the news, you see some type of horrific accident occurring on US-19, but we see it, we live it, uh, we're on the front end and in the trenches because our clients come to us after being involved in these horrific crashes on US-19 and ask for help. What, what, what are the steps? What, are the, what do we do next? Well, uh, just as a brief background, US-19 starts, although in Manatee County, uh, in Pinellas County, it runs from St. Petersburg and it heads north to south. It runs through Lealman, uh, Pinellas Park, Largo. Uh, it then enters Clearwater and then uh, Palm Harbor and then uh, Tarpon Springs before entering Pasco County. So it's a pretty long stretch. It is one of the most uh, heavily travel, traveled thoroughfares in Pinellas County. And as a result, it is always congested. And uh, we see a lot of actually uh, dangerous and reckless driving also on US-19. So back to the question, what steps do you take after being involved in some type of car accident or other accident on US-19? Well, first get yourself emergency medical treatment. It's very important you get checked out at a hospital or at an urgent care center. While you're at the scene, always contact the police and take the witness information uh, down yourself. Get names, contact information for anyone that saw the accident. And then also take pictures, pictures of the cars, the damage to each one of the cars, and also pictures to any of your injuries. Next, we encourage you to contact a car accident lawyer. Hopefully it's us. And then you'll be directed to a specialist that handles car accident injury cases. What you'll see is that many general practitioner, practitioners and family law doctors, they do not handle car accident injuries. And that's because of the complexities of the insurance company billing process. So you'll need to be sent to a, a doctor or a group of doctors that specialize in car accident injuries. And we know everyone in Pinellas County. And we only work with the best doctors. We do not work with people that are just simply out to bill your insurance uh, and not give you proper medical treatment. We just don't act that way here. Uh, we have a reputation to uphold and we care about our clients and we only work with, the metal, met with medical professionals who do the same. So after we refer you out to a medical provider uh, and you start your medical treatment, we will set up a claim with the at-fault driver's insurance company, whether it's a truck, car, what, whatever the case may be. We set up that claim and we also look toward your own insurance policy to see if there's any uninsured motorist coverage uh, as a pot of last resort. At the end of the day, we'll compile the records and we'll submit an appropriate demand to the insurance company for the compensation that you deserve for your injuries. So if you have any questions about a car accident or any other type of accident that occurred on US-19 in Pinellas County, please contact us for a free consultation.